Of course, uh, I played in, from 1970 to 74. I want to recognize David Macon, though. He's a teammate of mine, started for three years. Stand up, David. I'm going to embarrass you. He was a defensive back. He's a, uh, we get too much credit for quarterbacks. I'll be the first to tell you that. Dave, our defense was great during the 70s. But, uh, yeah, competition is, is big. Coach Bryant back in the 70s and the wishbone alternated quarterbacks whether you wanted him to or not. And uh, I'll never forget, uh, I backed up Terry Davis in 1972. And uh, uh, I played a little bit, you know, we alternated. I didn't play probably 20, 30% of the time, but I played. The next year, in 1973, I had to earn my position uh, during the spring. And uh, uh, during that time, I, I had to, to uh, deal with Richard Todd. Richard Todd was a freshman who was highly recruited. And he was a sophomore in 1973, and I was a junior. Uh, I, I earned the position to start, and our first game was against California. We beat them 66 to nothing. That was my first game to start. And I was excited. I had a fairly good game. Well, Richard had a good game, too. Well, I'll never forget the Bear Bryant show. Uh, Coach Bryant says, well, if I don't miss my guess, Richard Todd's going to be the next Joe Namath. <laughs> I'm sitting there watching it at home. <laughs> yeah, a lot of y'all probably remember that. That's a true story. So here I am, finally starting. I'm so excited. And he's more or less telling me that Richard's going to beat me out. Well, that fired me up, to be honest with you. Me and my dad. If you don't know my dad, he fired it. That upset him, too. So. That whole year, I started, and Richard came in after me, and we, we would alternate things. But it just kept me motivated to continue to play. Now, I don't know if Coach Bryant used that as a trick to get me fired up or not. I don't know. That's something he probably did, but I really don't think he did. I think he meant that. So, uh, <laughs> so anyway, I, I played all the, uh, played my junior year, and then, of course, my senior year, I was hurt. And uh, Richard ended up starting, and they didn't miss a lick. They went 11 know that year uh, without me. Which was fine. Uh, Richard had a lot more talent than I did, but I just uh, was fortunate enough to have ran an option offense in high school. And, and uh, when we went to the wishbone, it was fit for me. And uh, you could, uh, the wishbone was one of those kind of offenses where you could uh, eliminate two guys by the uh, read that the quarterback did. Either give it to the fullback or run it or pitch it off another guy. Neither of them were blocked. And uh, that's what was so beautiful, and nobody had picked up on defending it while we were there in the early 70s. And uh, it was just a blessing to have been able to play for Coach Bryan and, and uh, run a wishbone and be a part of something great uh, during that 70 period.